Hey guys, so I wanted to just talk about how important it is to maintain holistic wellness while studying. So I'm going to be sharing some tips on maintaining that holistic wellness. As most of you guys know, I'm a former psychotherapist. I'm also someone that has generalized anxiety disorder as well as ADHD. So I wanted to talk about what helped me during the process and what can help you. So the first thing is physical wellness. Let's start with physical wellness. It's easy to neglect this when you're focused on studying, but it's crucial for your overall health and concentration. So regular exercise, aim for about 30 minutes of moderate exercise most days. This boosts your energy level and focus and is a great stress reliever. Another tip I would say is a healthy diet. Eating balanced meals fuels your body and your mind. Remember, include plenty of fresh fruits and vegetables if you can, lean protein, whole grains in your diet. Mental wellness. So let's consider your mental wellness state. Studying can be mentally exhausting, believe me, I know. So it's important to give your mind a break. Mindfulness practices, techniques like meditation, or simply focusing on your breath for a few minutes each day can help reduce stress and increase mental clarity. Taking breaks, that's essential. Remember, it's okay to take breaks. In fact, breaks can increase your productivity and creativity. So Consider using these techniques like the Pomodoro effect, where you study for 25 minutes and then you take a five-minute break. Emotional wellness. Finally, let's not forget about that. Connect with others. Make time to connect with your family and friends. It's important to have social connection and support. And please remember to do things that you enjoy. Make time for hobbies, activities that bring you joy and relaxation. Okay, so if you get anything else from this video, I want you to remember this. Remember, studying for your social work exams is a marathon. It's not a sprint. It's important to maintain holistic wellness along the way. Okay, so I encourage you today to incorporate some of these tips into your study routine and get the studying, but also stay well balanced. Hopefully that was helpful. Take care, guys. Until next time. Bye.